in the recent days, weeks, months, whatever it may be, a certain YouTuber has, uh, or a certain weasel has risen to popularity. You might have seen him. His name is Nut Three Opner. Now he likes to be called Neon, but that's just not how you spell it. So I, I, I just can't. I refuse. He puts numbers in his name still, like we're playing Fortnite in fucking 2008, mate. I'm not taking him seriously. He's 19. Jesus, I'm almost cyberbullying. But I'm honestly, I've seen this little weird freak of nature upload so many weird videos. He, if you don't know who he is, he's a streamer. Now Neon, he is this guy. You've seen him. He's hanging out with like that Aiden Ross fella and all them stuff. And he's done loads of terrible lies. He said loads of things like fat shaming people, calling people gay or whatever. And look, I'm not here for that. People say it online all the time, you know what I mean? He's just a little, little ah! who's clearly risen to fame and popularity somehow. He used to play NBA. Okay. Let's just have a quick look. So he faked his own death, pretended that he died. It's unfortunate that he came back. We all would have preferred it if he never made a return and just stayed in the grave or the fake grave. Lying about COVID. So lied, said he had coronavirus. Pathetic. Oh, let, let's look at the trivia. The fucking trivia. He's Indian. Who would have thunked it? He plays Fortnite. No, uh, he has Crohn's disease. Fuck his Crohn's disease. Crohn's disease is a type of bowel disease. <laughs> Bro's got bowel issues, man. <laughs> the, the, Bro's got bowel issues. Probably not the only issues this man's got. I'm sure he's got a couple brain cells unconnected in the old brain rooney Parents must have dropped him on his head probably numerous times, probably kicked him about or something like that. He's probably played too much Fortnite. His brain has turned to kapush. What I wanted to show you guys is this absolute freak. He's basically running around like Jimmy Savile would run around a school park. I mean, it's crazy what he does. I'm going to show you the video. You guys can watch it for yourselves and let me know what you think. I'm going to show you a tweet as well that Andrew Tate said. Now, I'm, you know, don't believe Andrew Tate is a man of wisdom, to be honest with you. I don't really know what he says either. I try to stay away from sort of uh, people like that because I just can't be asked. But he said some very wise words. <laughs> Bro just asked, can you shake some ass on me? What a virgin is this guy? I thought he had a girlfriend. I mean, this is pathetic. He does not know what... He's dressed as bloody Batman. It's terrible. He had to run away because he was about to bloody cremate his underpants. He's literally 19 and he's going around asking girls. This is like illegal behaviour. I'm pretty sure this gets... If you were a 50-year-old man doing this, you'd get put in prison, mate. Off the jail, cowboy. <laughs> He's he can't believe what planet he's on right now. He has no idea what sort of situation is going on. He's asking all these girls who might be of, you know, any age, let's say. He's 19. I swear you have to be 21 to drink in the United States. Somebody call the cops. Don't... As you can see, the bro is a freak of nature and a proper uh, going around asking girls to shake their ass on them while streaming on Twitch or whatever. It's just hella, hella sus, bro. I'm getting real weird vibes from this bro. And look, I'm not, you know, don't judge a book. I'm sure he's a weirdo in real life as well. But this is extremely freaky. No, I believe in karma. Especially after last night. And I believe all things happen for a reason. This guy's got her, got his uh, own back, shall we say. This woman, or oh, man, oh fuck. It's a man transitioned into a woman, so it's a woman. This lady right here is about to ruin his night and probably his whole career. Fingers crossed, I hope so. Can I slap it? Can I slap your cheeks, yo? Basically, can I spank your butt? It's a very weird thing to ask. It probably would get any normal person in trouble, but because this guy's loved by the internet for some reason, I think he's an absolute freak in nature. He's almost as bad looking as me. I take top spot, mate, so I'll give him that. He's got a cute pair of glasses on. But what the fuck is wrong with this guy? <laughs> Over. His life is done. He just realised she was a tranny. 
or he was a what do you say he was a tranny or she was a tranny i don't actually know let me know down below what you call them anyway what i call them is you just got pranked son you shake your ass like that you asking loads of weird random questions like can i clap your butt you know you gotta be a pretty sad desperate freak to do this if anyone else did this in a club and wasn't filming wasn't this guy you'd go that guy's a freak of nature i'm not sure what it's like in america but i promise you if this happened in the uk you'd get beaten the fuck up all right we don't do guns in this country we do glasses over the head we smash people's heads in all right we have a very violent culture here it stems from football everyone's obsessed with it and then it stems down through the children if you do weird shit in the nightclub you get punished all right i've seen it a billion times all a girl has to do is go up to someone else and say don't even have to be true to be honest this guy said this this guy's done that da, da, da. and you'll get about six big fucking rugby lads caving your head in now because i was so interested in this guy's i thought i'd come to his youtube channel let's see what brilliant videos he has firstly that picture is just shocking subscribe plus fuck no bro so he just does loads of shite videos uh at the end so he's got a girlfriend that's his girlfriend i've seen his girlfriend what's up guys i don't have time to <sighs> look how young he looks <laughs> Talk. I cannot explain what's happening right now. I can't explain. This kid used to play NBA, the sad freak, and now he's doing like live streams going around slapping girls' ass. This is where he started, and now look where he ends up. Imagine saying that money doesn't change your fam and fame doesn't change you. It's explain it in a second. Hold on, guys. Just look at this sad, this sad freak. Imagine uploading this. You could tell this guy was just that type in school who had zero friends. And look, I, you know, everyone likes to play video games. There's nothing wrong with that. But you have to be sociable, mate. You have to go outside your bubble. Filming this and putting this on YouTube is only going to detriment... De Detriment. Detriment? It's only going to cause problems for your social life, my friend. This is truly tragic and did not need to be shared with the universe. I mean, this is never going away. I noticed that the comments are turned off. I wonder why. Just look at this sad, sad man. Firstly, he needs to eat a little bit of chicken or something. He looks anemic. His kung fu skills, he's clearly never seen kung fu panda because this is just depressing. This is not how you get in a fight. Exactly what's happening right now. Oh my word, I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. Alright, listen, listen, now listen. I'm, I'm finally uh, far away from my house. You know, my parents aren't here anymore. So listen, this is what happened now. This is what happened, okay? Oh my. Bro's shocked he's seen a bird. He hasn't been allowed out of his house. This kid was clearly kept in his parents' basement for like his whole life and was never allowed out. I can just tell he has no social skills. He's, you know, his only best friend was his teddy bear. That he probably fucked at the same time. Now he's gone from this to now being able to go around filming slapping girls' bonders. I mean, look, let's be real, this is all jealousy. Clearly I'm just so depressed and miserable with my own life that this is just... What I've come to, I've got to bully a 19-year-old kid who's far younger than me, who's far cooler and more successful, who gets to go to Halloween parties dressed up as Batman and shake, you know, transgender booties in his privates. I mean, God, that's just the dream. That's the goal. Look, guys, I, I realise this is just cyberbullying, isn't it? I'm literally just bullying this kid. But he fucking deserves it. I hate this kid. Look at his little face. He's got such a punchable little face. I'm going to slap... I want to... <laughs> I'm gonna hit him. But yeah, guys, look at this. I mean, I think this is his girlfriend, by the way. So he's just gone and cheated on her, put it on Twitch, and got loads of girls shake her their bundas in his face. Some people just should not have the ability to access the internet. This human being right here is one. Dude, neon is top of kick. That's that's what he's t what do people watch him for i'm just i'm gobsmacked anyway guys look this is clearly just cyberbully i'm a bad human being but i think you can all agree he's a bit of a scoundrel a bit of a scumbag a bit of a weirdo i think this is anyone else they would have been cancelled three billion years ago